Hi, we're back with virtualphoneline.com and today's demonstration will be how to buy a virtual phone line number. We will log into our virtual phone line account at virtualphoneline.com with our user ID and our password which will take us to our portal. Then we click on buy number. We have two methods of searching for numbers that we want to buy. Let's say we want a Mexico Mexico City phone number. So we would put in 5255, click search to see what's available. And we can see that we have a choice of five different Mexico City phone numbers. Very good rate, $2.50 set up, $5 per month. Or we can choose to save money by paying just a simple setup fee and getting a discount by paying one year in advance. But let's look at the other way of choosing phone numbers. The second way that we can choose a phone number is by clicking on the country drop down box and browsing the list of countries that are available. So let's say for example we want a USA phone number. We click search and we see that we have several, several area codes in the United States that are available to virtual phone line customers. So let's say that we want a Toledo, Ohio phone number. We would click here. We would be given a choice of several Ohio numbers, Toledo, with a zero setup fee and a monthly rate of $3.95 or a discount when we pay one year in advance, $47.40. So let's say that I want to get the discount because I plan to keep this number for at least one year. So I click on 4740. It tells me I've selected this number. This is correct. If I make this phone number ring to another uh, online or offline end device, there will be a one cent per minute receiving charge. There are 5,000 included minutes. So for example, if this is made to ring to another number, the per minute charge should be one cent per minute. When it rings to a SIP address, there should be at least 5,000 included free minutes. SIP address meaning when you make it ring to Free World Dial-Up, Gizmo Project, and any soft or hard phone SIP device. There are other videos at virtualphoneline.com slash video that will explain ring to. So let's say I will click to add this number to my cart, and then I will click check out. I see that I have funds already, $53, so that's enough. I've been informed that I have a virtual phone line that's been added to my account, so I'll take a look by going to my number, drag to view all my numbers, click to choose, and I see my original South, Carolina, South California Los Angeles number, my free trial Paris number that I'm trying out. Uh, I need to let go of it, I believe, by November 10th if I don't wish to pay for it or I will choose to make it permanent before November 10th. I have 25 days free trial. Now back to the number that I just chose, it, I can make it ring to, I have just bought this number and then the next thing I will want to do is to click on ring to number. When I first check out the original ring to address, it is a default, but I can change to make the ring to a PSTN number, one that I've already chosen before by the PSTN history, or by clicking here and choosing where I want it to ring to, which phone number, which cell phone or landline I wish to make it ring to. Or I can choose a SIP address or an IAX2 address. I can make it ring to MSN Instant Messenger ID, Google Talk ID, or Gizmo Project ID as well as Free Will dial -up. We will see more about how to fix the ring to in a separate demonstration video. Thank you so much. Hope you enjoy using Virtual Phone Line to stay in touch with those who are important to you. They'll start calling you more often 
when you get a local number local to them.